Welcome back to the greatest show on the internet about crypto, except it's not the greatest. But hold on, we're talking about AP3, if that is how this is called. AP number 3. AP3. Again, a request from a friend, subscriber, so let's do it. What do I see on this chart? This is daily chart of AP3 versus dollar, very zoomed in approach. Has AP3 in the short term found its bottle? It's possible. Short term downtrend is broken, and I mean really short term. From the beginning of September, here we broke it to the upside. It's not that big of a deal, but we broke it. If we put the supportive line on these candles, we are getting a clear breakout from a falling wedge. This is bullish. And remember, I am still talking very, very short term. And if you think that something like this is not possible, I got the news for you. It is. But where is this thing going? Let's discuss it. Now by applying Fibonacci you can see that we were mingling about 61.8, found some kind of a bottom at this level, will this be enough? It's really based on this few candles, hard to tell. But if we reverse this, voila, something like this, and use this except of this pump, you can see that again 61.8 could be the answer. Because there is a chance that we are traveling to the level of 61.8 again. We are talking about a level of about 1.19, just below 120. There you go. Now, what could be stopping us right there? Do we have an answer? Well, I have. But first I need to zoom out for that answer to reveal. That is enough. I'll remove this, but I will leave this box. Because here, you see this peak. And you see what is happening. We are having lower high. So, what about the theory that AP3 is traveling to this line, to this box, and then making moves to the downside, or breaking to the upside, we still don't know that. Because if we look at the support, yeah, the theory about squeezing the price could be right, absolutely. So, I believe that the pump to 120 is now a possibility, but what will happen after that, that is another question. But I want to zoom out to show you something even more interesting, and that's enough. This line will now become this line to give it a level of 88 cents, as you can see why. Here points of support, here points of support, and again points of support. So if everything fails that we're talking right now, this could be the target to the downside. 88 cents, AP3, very high probability zone for buying, okay? Now, please watch this line of resistance and watch me zooming out. What do you see? Again, pretty high touch in March. So, this is a falling line that has many, many significant values for AP3. If this line break, and I told you 120 is where it should be in the next couple of days, then we are having a bull case. But if we follow the strategy of going with the trend, then it will not break. It will push the price lower, possible to do 88 cents. This is just the simplest technical analysis that you can find, but simplest is the best. Okay, but let's make it even more simple. How about this? Zoom in, zoom in, zoom in. Okay. How about making this line as a big resistance? Excellent. So, how about that this is our support 88 cents and this is our resistance 130. They're really getting all the answers. Support, resistance. Look at this point of resistance, 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 resistance. So we can say that in the last few months AP3's price was bounded by two important levels, 88, 130. This is technical analysis 101, pure basics. But what do you see when I apply this volume? That this volume, look at this, non-existent. But here, when we touch the support, huge volume. Also touching the resistance, huge volume. Here also a big point of interest and so on. So those levels are proven it's worth. Okay, at the end moving average to keep you in check. So what's to check? The check is something very important so we will zoom out. I mean, zoom in. Back to the basics from the beginning of this video. What do you see on this chart? You should see that we are range bounded and we are going up and down and up and down and up and down. 
more important, you can see that we are at this moment at the crucial point of resistance. So, all this narrative about those using advanced Fibonacci stuff and blah 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 are not important if we cannot break this level of prices whereabouts at this moment, $1.06 or $1 at 7 cents when this moving average is. By the way, this is if you don't know the band of 21 exponential and simple moving average that I created for the clear head check. What is this meaning? This meaning that a move to that 88 cent shouldn't surprise you at all. But I mean at all because we are at the lower band, we are below it. And this is serving us as a support and resistance, but a dynamic one, not the static as we discussed earlier. My final word to AP3 holder, how should you approach this? If you can't see price above 107, you are not in the clear. And I gave you those static lines, even if you are in the clear. So in the short term, there is a lot to be done regarding this coin. Stay safe. That's my final word. But if everything fails, why not go to 88 cents and then find that level as a final sanctuary. Hope you found some value in this. I hope I will see you in my next video. Thank you.